I'm Amy Mewborn, the founder of Fit in 60 and Amy Mewborn Fitness. And today we're going to talk about personal branding versus the brand of a franchise. Uh, one of the biggest benefits of going with a franchise is the fact that there's already an established brand and there's already some brand awareness. So if you go to Chicago and you went and found one of the large bar franchises, you would know exactly what to expect in opening, in going into that studio. Whereas if a visitor comes into your studio, they often maybe don't know what to expect. So if they were looking at maybe one of the large franchisors versus your studio, they may choose something that they already know. However, I will tell you this. When you open your studio, one of the biggest things that is important to your clients is your community and your culture. So you may not necessarily have visitors coming in, but once you get the word out in your community, you're probably going to have a tremendously loyal client base. So yes, branding is important. Yes, it is nice to have that big brand behind you. However, once you go out and you open your studio and you're building your own community, you'll find that it really doesn't matter so much anymore. Uh, when you consider what you would spend to launch with a franchise, it's probably about forty to fifty thousand dollars as a bare minimum. And then they're normally going to take, let's just say, six to seven percent of your gross revenue. So just imagine with that forty thousand dollars what you could do in terms of marketing and branding your space. So if you were to break that down, it works out to be about $3,500 or so a month. So just think about that before you make a decision and know that all you have to do is put in the time and put in the effort to build your brand and you're going to feel a tremendous sense of pride in your studio, your brand, and your culture. If you have any questions, reach out. I look forward to talking to you soon.